corner, sturdy built green houses here in Portland, Oregon. Today's tour is going to be of our uh, Tudor model. Uh, and here's a sample, it's an 8x9 size. We designed the uh, Tudor in the uh, early 1990s uh, when they were building a lot of uh, new home construction using a Tudor Gothic type design. And you can see that we've emulated that design with a steep roof pitch, uh, curved uh, brackets in the corners, a curved uh, uh, piece of glass above the door, and a curved piece of glass in the door. We've also uh, uh, added some uh, details uh, and some curves down here in our base wall van openings uh, to add to that uh, uh, architecture of the Tudor Gothic type of uh, construction. At the non-door end here we have uh, curved arches cut into the uh, corners of the construction. And then at the end wall, we have a, a, an arch in the, uh, the full bay uh, uh, center at the uh, greenhouse end wall. Along with the architectural features on the outside, we have several of these architectural features on the inside of the greenhouse. And starting with the uh, artisan made uh, wood handle. And then inside, we've, uh, we've We've taken that same curve that we used on the outside corner detail and created these curved gussets. This particular architecture with a steep roof pitch creates a very uh, tall uh, center uh, peak to the roof. This uh, eight foot uh, wide model, which is fairly narrow, uh, is, is almost nine feet tall in the middle. Um, along with these architectural features, as with all uh, sturdy built greenhouses, we have condensation control. We put a gutter on the inside to catch condensation that's coming down the, uh, the glass glazing uh, on the inside and then uh, run it down a drain tube so we drain that down to the bottom to keep the water from dripping on your plants and onto you. Although we've uh, sold the uh, Tudor uh, to many customers across the United States, uh, primarily due to its architectural design, another feature to it is the steep roof pitch has uh, become a, uh, a very nice feature for uh, people that live in heavy snow areas. That steep roof pitch will not allow snow to accumulate, uh, so if you're in a, an area that has uh, uh, three to ten foot of snow uh, every winter, um, this will uh, shed that snow and you don't have to worry about the uh, greenhouse collapsing uh, due to uh, snow weight. As with all uh, sturdy built greenhouses, our Tudor model comes with uh, standard uh, roof ventilation system. Here you can see the, uh, the roof vent uh, partially open here as it's uh, approaching 75-80 uh, degrees. Uh, that works in conjunction with uh, lower ventilation and in our base walls we put screened uh, vent openings in the, uh, in, in the base uh, to draw fresh air in and let hot air uh, flow out of the roof vent. It's a very effective, uh, very quiet, very natural way to uh, vent a greenhouse. Besides the uh, 8 by 9 size that I have here in our display greenhouse, uh, we make the Tudor in a lot of different sizes. So I thought it'd be interesting to show a, a photo board here of, of, of different models that we made. Probably one of the larger ones we made is this uh, uh, 14 by 20 uh, uh, Tudor greenhouse uh, that's been stained gray. It is on a uh, masonry base wall, turned out beautifully. Another standard size is shown here. This is a, uh, uh, a night photo. Uh, this greenhouse has a grow light in the center. So you can see, uh, uh, very interesting, you can see the, uh, the arches in the end wall and, and the, uh, the architecture of the Gothic Tudor type style. Another example is this uh, 10 by 16 Tudor, which is mounted on a customer's deck in Alabama. He's a, an avid uh, uh, tropical orchid uh, plant grower. Uh, and his particular greenhouse, uh, all the other ones we've seen have been all glass, has uh, twin wall polycarbonate and twin wall polyethylene on the roof for extra diffusion uh, for his tropical plants. Uh, this is a custom greenhouse we built for a customer here locally. They had already had the uh, brick foundation uh, put in uh, as part of their landscape plan and they have several large uh, raised bed uh, gardens that use that same brick uh, layout and so we custom designed the uh, greenhouse to go right on top of that. I think that turned out beautifully in their landscape. We even make the Tudor in a lean-to version. Uh, this is a, a somewhat snowy uh, 
a photo of a customer in uh, southern Oregon uh, and they used a lava rock uh, uh, base uh, to set the, uh, the tutor on. And then finally here's an example of our 12 foot wide uh, tutor. Uh, this was one of the original, uh, was actually the original a 12 foot uh, tutor we made for a customer in Tennessee, uh, stained gray, beautifully done. It's on our uh, wood uh, base wall, which has also been stained gray to match the greenhouse. So, this should give you a, a good feeling for the uh, versatility of the tutor model and how we can uh, design it to fit into your landscape, uh, both with different sizes and different uh, greenhouse configurations, and match it up to uh, different uh, foundation and base walls uh, available.